Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today I can show you how to stack text in Illustrator. I'm going to make this video short and sweet by creating this tutorial right here. And of course, if you want to see the rest of the tutorials, how to add these effects and show you all the bells and whistles, you can click the join near the description. Most of the audience like short tutorials and I just going to drop the long videos in the YouTube membership. All right, first step, I'm going to select the rectangle, create a rectangle on the text and I'm going to right click, arrange center back. I'm going to select the typo and make it white. And I'm going to se select the black box. I'm going to press and hold alt and I make some distance in between the letters and the black box. And I'm also going to make it wide like this. I'm going to select all right click and group. I'm going to press and hold alt, drag it upwards, also press shift. So from here, we're going to make sure that this text is on the bottom and this is on the top. So I'm going to select this, right click, arrange, center back, select both, select the blend tool and click on this and then on this one. Now it's blended. I'm going to double click on the blend tool, select specify steps, increase the numbers. I'm going to go with 10, click OK. I'm going to select the direct selection tool, which is here. And so I'm going to go to this anchor point, click on it and we don't have any handles. So I'm going to go up here and make it curvy. So this is basically going to add handles, click on it. And as you can see, it added the handles. We're going to adjust this handle right here and I'm going to bring it up. I'm going to double click on this text. As you can see, we can select this text and now I'm going to Press and hold shift plus alt, scale it down. I'm going to also drag it down like this, make it curvy. And I also going to select the direct selection. Bring this here, press and hold alt, drag it to the right. I'm going to double click on this Panther text, double click. I'm going to select this typo. I'm going to press and hold shift, bring it down. And we're going to need to select the direct selection tool again and readjust the handle. So see this, this is the handle that we adjusted. So what I'm going to do is just rotate it downwards and press and hold shift to snap it here. Double click to release. I'm going to put it side to side, see what's going on. And I'm going to double click on the text and bring it right here, release. And I'm going to bring the typo right here. And this is how you make this uh, composition. Thanks for watching and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.